Some three and a half million people a year come to the shrine at Freeport, Maine, commonly known as L.L. Bean. What is it that attracts them? It's more than boots, bags, and bows and arrows. It's that magical bean mystique and the company's unparalleled reputation for service. Bean gives real meaning to the customer is king philosophy. Leon Leon Wood Bean, whom everyone knew as LL, was a perfectionist when it came to customer service. As his grandson recalled, to hear that one of his products failed was a shock to his system. He'd charge around the factory trying to find an explanation. Then he'd write the customer, return his money, and close a gift, invite him fishing, or do anything to make the matter right. I'm Greg Stone. Welcome to Business Chronicle. The company LL founded now has annual sales of $600 million, and it mails out 100 million catalogs like this one every year. And what a reputation. Customers can return any item, no questions asked, even decades later. Bean doesn't have to go back to basics. It's always been there. Wet feet. Leon Leonwood Bean couldn't stand them, especially when he was hunting. So in 1912, LL set out to do something about them. The end result was the main hunting shoe, part leather, part rubber. In 1988, Bean sold 283,000 pairs. But back in 1912, it was a different story. And he sold something like 100 pairs and got 99 of them back in the mail uh, because they uh, were unable to fasten the rubber top, or the rubber bottom to the leather top. And he, in fact, replaced them. Almost 80 years later, Beans will still replace them. That's part of their ironclad lifetime guarantee. But if the boots just need some TLC, they'll do that too. In 1988, 27,000 pairs of the hunting shoes were rebuilt at half the cost of a new pair. We've had them as old as 1947 which is my age, <laughs> so they've been old. These boots come from as far away as Hawaii, England, and Alaska, all with owners anxiously awaiting their return. Sometimes we get a little note with them saying, my dog is in the doghouse, these are my special boots, and can they be repaired? We give them a new top, send them back, and they're real happy. As the core product of L.L. Bean, the main hunting shoe illustrates how this mail order house has become an American success story. Many say L.L. Bean is like its home state of Maine, self-reliant, no nonsense, as predictable as the sunrise over Mount Katahdin. You can be cynical about L.L. Beans in some ways, but you cannot be cynical about their attempt to provide a durable quality product. To millions of Americans, the state of Maine and L.L. Bean are synonymous. They may never have traveled east of the Mississippi, but they feel a kinship for this company. It's an American marketing phenomenon. And every year, some three and a half million people come to Beans in person, like pilgrims flocking to a sacred shrine. They've arrived at the house L.L. built. When you see them out in the middle of the main street, as I did one time, a party drove in, they were crossing to Beans, and they stopped. They looked up there, and they threw up their hands, one of them said, we're here. 